Now we had done the add an entry to the database and we look for the delete of a selected uh, database uh, entry. So we go there to our database and we say here in your design go to the delete button and at the click event we do the same as before. We go there, we take it and we go to our buttons and we say delete um, delete a row of database quite simple at this moment or entry and we go there and we say we need a new private void uh, method called this way and we say okay we have done everything before oh I see like this we have done all the entries in our previous section with adding an entry. Now we do the same with our deletion of an entry. So we say we have here the string get the string connection state and then we want to delete the actual stuff that's what we do there and we need something and we take it again from the former uh, from my previous uh, stuff we say something like this I to take it there I explain it <coughs> we say um, we want the list the list of cars the selected item is a data row view when we click on there we have a data row view as a selected row and from there I want the idea of the car so this is from this row inside that's like the uh, database when I go there and show the day table now we have here the Chevy and the Daimler and the Fiat and the Volvo. Volvo. Then this row is a data row view called data row view. And we have one column ID car and uh, one is the car. So when I close it, we have here the row and the field is called is shown with these uh, brackets uh, and then we say give me the value of this as a string as uh, from the as a number five for example and we insert it here we say we say delete from the table cars where my id my car which is unique is my new id car so that's the point and then we do the same as before we say uh, go to the create a new command and execute this comma command we may um, uh, unify that point and do it more bit, bit, bit more simple but for the first point for this uh, section we it should be uh, enough okay now when we go to this fiat and we say delete then it w it is deleted so what happens there is we take a breakpoint there and we say like this we go, we go here now here and now we say delete that daimler and now when we go there as in the breakpoint we see the string id the, this row Give me, gives me the string uh, apostrophe three apostrophe three. This means it's a string, and we create a new string which is called SQL text, and it's delete from ID cars where ID equals three as a uh, as a number. If it would be a text, uh, the name for example, where uh, the car is called Volvo, then it ha should have uh, two apostrophes uh, on there. So we get it in the command and then we run it and that's 
it. Now that's what we see there. 